Look at that action. Check this action out right here. We have a nice little drawer action there. I don't think there's anything else unless there's clothes in those coal bags. I think there's a little vacuum over to the left as well. Take a look at that. All right, there's action over the here and there has been over the last couple days, but people have their garage doors open. So hold on one second. We might have to go around and take a closer look for sure. Wowzers, folks, whole bag of CDs. I actually left those, took the helmet, took the jogging water belt thing, took the bag of electronics with the cables and ethernet cables in there. Don't know exactly know what's in there quite yet. It's all in the back of the car right here. Great little pickup right there. Oh, did I mention I grabbed the toaster that was in the same cans as the Samsung television? Turning out to be a fantastic day, thank you, Jesus. Hey, take a look at that, that's vintage, baby. Man, I think my dad had that backpack when we were kids. Okay, looks like the TV is still there. I got someone creeping up on me right now. And we got Christmas ornaments, hey. All right, let's go check out these Christmas ornaments real quickly, see if we wanna go snag them real quick. There's a parking spot open right here. The LG TV is still there and we have a wreath and looks like some really nice ornaments. So let me go grab those. Maybe Mr. Sleepslot can use them for his house or his tree. All right, we got an Ikea bookshelf right over here. It looks like the lady has now vacated the perimis. That looks really nice. That's actually in great condition there. Looking really spot on fantastic. I think we just saw some action here. Hold on one second. I think we got like a baseball bag and stuff. Let's hit the Snapchats. That was actually a tennis racket bag and we scored a nice little wooden chess set with the pieces inside. They were jingling around. Hopefully they're all there. And again, a lot of this stuff I just grabbed. There was a maintenance guy's golf cart parked right out front. And a lot of this stuff I just grabbed to rescue it. If I don't need it, I'll give it away. I'll donate it to Salvation Army. So great scores, great scores. I want to capture this on film here. This guy has house goals right here. Look at his patio. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome, man. I hope you get a, your own house. You're gonna be like the next Chevy Chase. We got a really nice vacuum creeping behind that half wall. What is that one? It looks real nice. That's a bristle. Bristle or a Hoover, pick it up. Wanna get this on camera real quick. We have ourselves a nice entertainment center. Looks like a cable down there as well. Very nice solid wood. Let's go, baby. I saw this creeping. What do we got? Woo, all right now. Little sleigh bed, looks like it might be a queen. Not exactly sure here. We got the side slats in, uh, let's see here. The slide slats should be inside the cans there. We're looking real good, folks. That might be a queen black sleigh bed, very nice. We got some metal scrap in here, I'll tell you what. All right guys, this might be quick because there was people around just a second ago. It's around that dinner time-ish time. There's a bicycle. Looks like a DLP TV. Let's shine some light, see what's up. That was a sweet score right there. I took 
the three desktop computers. They're a little bit older, at least one of them. One was another Dell, but again, memory hard drives, guys, it sells, baby, even the vintage ones. Now, check this out. I was actually diving. I grabbed one. I put it in my car, and the guy that was throwing the stuff away was walking in with a mattress, and I said, you know what? I'm here. I'm right here, baby. So I actually went back in the walkway, and I'm like, hey, I'm going to reach behind you. I'm going to recycle these, which is true, but I'm going to sell the components side first. He was actually just throwing away more stuff, and I saw a cord in his hand. I don't know what it led up to, but he actually had his Porsche outside the garage as he's trying to make room for his Porsche in his garage. This could mean business, baby. Check it out here. I was able to grab this little tin guy. I think food or something came in that. I was able to grab this, which I think is a bag of coffee. Fast set bag refill. What is that? No, I don't know what that is. I don't know. I got to figure that out. I thought that was coffee. I think that's for like something else. Anyway, we'll figure that out. And check this out. Steel cut non-GMO oatmeal. Brand new. That's worth something. And then check this out. These people are crazy. That's like three or four dollars organic old-fashioned oatmeal. Brand spanking new. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Food come ups right there. We eating and we watching free TV. It's going to be a little dark to see, but that's a beautiful lamp laying down on its side. Excellent. All right, we just crept over here. Let's see what's up. Let's see if we need to get out here. Uh, we got a, oh, a nice white fan. I think we need that. We need a spare one. Uh, pillows. Let's see what else we got. We got what looks to be like a white leather love seat. Very nice. Mr. Sleeps a lot was hunting some cans, grabbing that cube thing. And he saw a stroller, he went in for the kill, and somebody swooped him right behind him. He was like, what's the dillio baby? All right, we got nothing. Okay, continue forward. Anyway, Mr. Sleepslot was salty. He got swooped on. He was gonna have himself a $50 come up right there. But good news, the 40 inch Samsung LCD TV worked like a boss, Mr. Sleep said. So he was excited about that one. Plus he grabbed that 47 inch LG, the razor thin one that looked like someone had already tried to take it apart. Okay, here's one reason why nighttime diving is a little bit tough. Okay, that could be a box, that could be a side end table, or that could be a desktop computer. If I'm lucky, it'll be a desktop computer. Well, the closer you get, you realize a triangle is not a desktop computer, but it was a very nice end piece nonetheless. What in the world? It's dark. You guys can't really see that. That whole entire walkway is full of the McGillicuddy's. I think I see a coffee table. Those might just be boxes. And I think the person that has all this stuff, their garage, is open right there. So I might just jump out right here. Well, what I thought was a coffee table was actually an outdoor table slash bench type thing that we saw. Very nice, actually. Alrighty, let's check this out. I rolled by it. Sometimes you gotta roll by it and then sometimes you gotta pounce on it right away. We have ourselves an office chair, a beautiful regular armchair, some bags and trash here. But, uh, oh goodness gracious, man, that blue armchair back there is gorgeous, not to mention a nice little vented office chair there. Wowzers. Again, remember, this is my newest secret baller town complex. Like I said there, there is a DLP, older DLP. Man, that's a lot of DLPs lately. I'm looking at what I think is a pair of UGG slippers, if not ones just like it, right there on the wall. And those look like they might be Natalie's size or her mom's size, and her mom is still in town. Let's go grab those bad boys. All right, you guys are gonna love this. Sorry about my windshield here. Let's see if they're still there. Looks like they left already. Wait, is this the one? Oh, this isn't even the one. That was a photograph one. Hold on, 
It's around the corner. Sorry, down over here. These guys are loading up a U-Haul over here to the right, and then these cans right here, there's a, unfortunately, let's see, yep, they're still there. Look at that action. Oh, is that a fresh box? Ooh, and a stool. Okay, they put a stool over there now, too. Wow, a lot of amazing stuff tonight. That was a probably minimum 50 inch Philips television crack on the very top, unfortunately, but very nice nonetheless. And then what was up with that like Ikea glass top for like watches, a display case on top of the Ikea? Drop dead gorgeous. Now let's go get some sushi. <laughs> Every day and every night, every night. Every day and every night, every night.